This box showed up at my door today. There is a very powerful scooter in here, one as fast as the 72 volt Suron. So without further ado, let's check it out. All right, let's check this out. Oh, that's heavy. Very excited, Whoa, very excited about this. Oh my God, that's big. Oh my God. Whoa, oh, I'm scared of this already. Damn, that's big. That is big. That's what she said. <laughs> Okay, let me get this set up and then I'm gonna tell you what we're looking at. Ooh. I just unboxed the Nanrobot LS7 Plus. This scooter goes 75 miles an hour. Let that sink in. It weighs 100 pounds. It has dual motors. Each motor pulls 2,400 watts. The battery is larger than a Suron. It's a 60 volt, 40 amp hour battery, which gets about 40 miles of range. It has dual suspension, dual hydraulic disc brakes, LEDs, turn signals, a steering damper, everything you could imagine on a scooter. I am already terrified of this. I haven't even ridden it yet. So let's go ahead and take it out on the road. I'm gonna get geared up and we're gonna see what this scooter can really do. All right, here goes nothing. Turn that on, hit this. Beautiful display. I'm starting off in absolutely the lowest mode possible. So mode one in uh, single motor drive. What the fuck is this? <laughs> Holy shit, I saw it just now in the back. Dude, 75 miles an hour. What's he whipping? <laughs> yeah. Already pretty fast. This is like faster than most electric scooters. I'm going 35 kilometers an hour. I love how slow it starts. Some other scooters, you hit the throttle and it's just like, oh. Let's go up into dual motor. Ooh, ooh, oh, okay. And I'm also gonna go into turbo in the highest gear so in theory this is as fast as this thing can go Whew. let's get it there's no way this is full of power i guarantee you it goes faster than this i'm going 54 kilometers an hour what happened to that 75 miles an hour let me figure this out i know i'm missing something no problem go for or we'll move out of your way So slow. Okay, I think I figured it out. I thought I was in e I thought I was in turbo, but I think I was in eco. Let's see how this does. Oh, 36 miles an hour, 40 miles an hour, 45 miles an hour, <laughs> 47, 48. I do not want to go any faster. Okay, it's kind of topping out there. Oh. 
Still not hitting the alleged 75 miles an hour. Although in complete honesty, no part of me wants to go faster than I just went. Oh my God, I'm flying. Yes, this is sick. Ready? Check this out. Check this out. Oh wait. Boom. Sheesh. What color should we do? Red? Bam! Sheesh. Whoa, this is cool. It's so illegal though. You can't ride on the street with like a blue light. But I like it blue. Ooh, what's that? That doesn't look very good. What? The, oh, the... <laughs> LED's <laughs> tripping out. Doesn't look very clean. I, it's because I turned it if you turn it to the max brightness it starts tripping out a little bit look at that too much power or maybe it's supposed to do that I don't think so <laughs> no shot <laughs> no shot <laughs> that's your that's the accelerator oh. right there okay. <laughs> send it Not 75 though, we're only hitting like 49 right now. It is still kind of sus. It is sus. I don't think it, I want it to go any faster. Oh, that's plenty, bro. Right? And that's the fastest mode? That I can find. Dude, this is nice. Hit me with the headlight again. Ooh. What the fuck is all this shit? It's a steering damper. Look at that, it is lit up. I like that, that's cool, yeah. Jump on it. Whoa. Yeah. Exactly, yeah. Quick comment. This stays blue. Very blue. That's illegal in the US. Like you can't ride on the street with a blue light because you could be mistaken for a police car, so. Okay, it's a couple days later and I've got a couple updates. First update, this thing is still incredibly intimidating to get on. So we had 70 mile per hour winds last night and this is what every tree in the area is looking like. Not looking good. Oh. <laughs> Thanks, dude. I appreciate it. Damn. Okay, we're going off-road. All of this is just fallen tree material. I'm mean, I'm going over it. So, basically, my thoughts on the scooter are as follows. I'm very impressed. However, I was misled by their initial emails to me. They said in the email it goes 60 to 75 miles an hour, which is exactly what I said at the beginning of the video because that was my understanding. Now the scooter is very fast. It is not 60 to 75 miles an hour. Oh, it gets air. I like that. Oh man, another roadblock. Look at this. <laughs> it's sad, dude. These trees take like hundreds of years to grow. <laughs> So I sent them an email and I said, hey, you said it goes 60 to 75. I'm only getting about 50. They said, yeah, well, it actually goes 55 miles an hour. Um, but even that, I'm not, I'm not seeing 55. Good suspension, good brakes. It's got the steering stabilizer on it. That was a little sketchy. I'm not doing that again. But I am whipping right now and it's fun. Okay, I'm not doing that again. It's possible, but it's not enjoyable. Look at this tree. Damn. It was windy last night. Curb test, curb test. Passed. Now going up a curb test. It just barely clears it.
Okay, I just fully wiped out trying to do the smallest corner ever on this thing. I thought it would be a cool clip going around the corner and it just slid right out. Okay, it is the next day and that fall yesterday did me dirty. I sprained my right shoulder so I've got this makeshift sling going on. Thankfully I was wearing knee pads, I hit my knee pretty hard, I was wearing gloves, my hand slid. So other than the shoulder I'm good to go. But I think I'll be out for about a week at least with this. Fortunately, I have a lot of videos saved up. So there will be videos posting twice a week as always. As far as my thoughts on the scooter, I'm very impressed. I'm still terrified of it, especially after the fall. I think it goes more than fast enough at 50 miles an hour. It's got great suspension, great brakes. I think the lights look really cool at night. It's really cool having a motor in both the front and rear wheel and having the ability to select between single and dual wheel drive. It's heavy, but it folds up nicely in your car. As far as electric scooters go, from what I've seen, this is about as beefy as they come. If you're interested in picking one of these up for yourself, there should be a discount code below. Massive shout out to Nanrobot for giving me this opportunity. Thank you guys so much for watching these videos. And as always, stay tuned. Yeah.